Welcome back everybody to another tutorial. This time what we're going to be talking about is uh, fellowship moves. So, fellowship moves. Now this is the basic introduction. They're also known as conjunctions. So, excuse my messy writing. What they can also be shortened down to in a lot of fellowship chat and things like that is um, either FM for fellowship move or fellowship maneuver um, or CJ for conjunction. So if somebody says the CJ is something, that's what that means, the conjunction of fellowship move. So what is it? It basically is a series of colors and... Um, things that will pop up on the screen that you have to press. Now it's a bit hard to show you just by drawing it so what I've got is got a screen capture here, a little bit of a capture of what happens when your fellowship has a fellowship move. And so what you can see here is, is something appears on your screen and it's got four colors. Now these are actually buttons, each one of these colors is a button that you can click on. So what you can do is you can click on one of these colors when a fellowship, and you have to be in a fellowship for this to come up, you will cannot get this to pop up if you're just soloing. So um, what do these colors all mean and what do they all stand for? So first of all what we'll talk about is this red one here and the red one, red, um, is a tree. Excuse my handwriting, I'm going to write that better. Right. Red is a tree. Now why do I actually say red tree? Uh, the reason is is because some people are, have color, blind, uh, color blindness issues and can't actually tell the different colors on the circle. So if you're a leader of a fellowship or you're wanting to explain what color somebody should put in, that's how you do it. You say the color and the, the icon that's on that that circle that you want them to press. So it's a red tree. And what does a red tree do? Well if you click on that your thing will be what's called DD or direct damage. Direct damage means that all it does is just directly does damage. It just is a hit. Like it, it it's a one-off hit. So that's that's what the red one does. The green one here, which is a bird or eagles, um, it's a, um, uh, it's known as eagle's ear, I think. But um, so you might want to say eagle, or you might want to say bird. So it depends on the group. And what does this do? Um, this does is most of the time this does uh, heal over time. It's known as. So heal over time. And this is what you'll see. You'll see HOT or DD or something like that. You'll see people using those, um, those mentions in uh, blog posts or even when you're chatting to them. And they'll say it's got a hot or heal over time. Um, so the next one we've got here is this yellow one. And yellow and it's a spider and the spider does um, a dot D-O-T um, and that is damage over time now you'll notice that the red one and the, the yellow one here are related in some way, um, but the, they're doing damage. So they're both doing um, damage, and whilst one does just a direct one-off big hit of damage, this one does damage over time. It does a bit of a hit, and then it, it'll still just, you know, slowly tick away uh, at, at an enemy. And this is why this one is also known as uh, that it does a bleed. So it's like a wound that just keeps sapping away their energy. So that's what the, the yellow one here does. Now the last one is obviously blue and it has, I shouldn't say obviously, but it is a horse. 
And this uh, does a, um, well, not big, we'll just say we'll do power, power regeneration. So it just does power. And it is pretty much direct power, you know. So what you'll notice is that the these these two are related and these two are related. Um, one, the red and the yellow, uh, the tree and the spider, are doing damage to an enemy. Whereas the horse and eagle, or the horse and bird, uh, blue and green, is doing a buff to you or your fellowship. Um, it gets more complicated than this, but this is the basic mechanics. The basic mechanics of a conjunction. This is what all the different colours mean. So that you can understand when you're putting in a red, um, that that's what the outcome of that red will be. Um, so that'll cover that for now, I think, and, and that's a, a good, simple explanation of a, a basic uh, Fellowship Move um, a panel uh, description. It'll give you an idea of where things uh, lie so that we can build on them in, uh, in further um, tutorials. Enjoy!